All right, welcome to Witcher Wednesdays. Obviously, I know it's not an original name. Many people did that last year when the game first came out. However, I was not one of them, so I am streaming now for Witcher Wednesdays. This is going to go for about two hours every week. Um, I have a few more details up on my site, griffinspen.org, if you'd like to check out the details. Leave your comments there if you want to or on the YouTube uh, page when this goes up there. Um, my plan for this is that during the two hours we'll be concentrated mostly on some of the main side quests, you know, the ones with the major characters um, and the main story quest, of course. Concentrating mostly on those. Obviously this is a long game, so I might play a little bit, you know, just get a few levels, a few levels up. Uh, play the, you know, the smaller stuff, the basic Witcher contracts, you know. Go to this graveyard, kill this grave hag, go to this forest, kill this spriggan. You know, the basic Witcher contracts, I might do those off stream just to keep the flow going. So what we have here on Wednesdays is a nice, tight, story-packed episodes. So that's my plan for that. Uh, after I'm done recording here tonight, this will go up on YouTube, hopefully not too long after. I have to figure out how to edit this stuff. I don't think it's too difficult, but I'll take a look at it. And so with that, I'll also link it back to my site on our media page from YouTube. So it'll be there in three places, because the archive will obviously be here on Twitch as well. If you want to listen to my 15 minute or so warm-up for myself, having never done this before. So, without further ado, we're going to New Game, New Game Plus. I did just the story the first time. I think I'm going to play Story and Sword this time. You must have a little bit more of a challenge than I did last time. Uh, we, yes, we're going to simulate a Witcher 2 save. Continue. From sort of new game plus, you must first use a save made after completing the standard version of the game. Okay. So if I wanted to, I could go all the way back to here. Something ends, something begins. I kept this save, as you can see, version 1.08. This was my original save that I when I completed the game the first time. The main story. This one here is the last save I have after completing the main quest of the expansion, Blood and Wine. Uh, and then these are a couple other saves that I have. This one here is a save I have. I might have to go back to this. I have one of the quests... I probably messed it up. There's one of the quests that I did, side quests of... that I didn't complete before I beat the main story. And it is now... I cannot... the NPC I did talk to was missing. Um, so, I don't know if that's a fix coming or if that's intentional, that he's just gone because he died in it. I'm not going to spoil that stuff, we'll save that for later, we hopefully we'll get there eventually, hopefully not too long down the road. But for now we're going to load from my latest save here from just a few minutes ago. And we're going to see where that puts us. aspects to seeing, okay, this branch was snapped, we need to follow this, this stuff was dropped here, we need to follow that. Little things like that. Great context to this. We do that in all of the cinematic shows in this game. Right? But they, cinematic, not representative of actual gameplay, but 
but still showcased things you're doing in the game. It was the other cinematic one with him fighting the Bruxa. With the Bruxa. The vampire. And, you know, he takes the black blood portion, grabs a moon dust bomb. Comments on the site, leave your comments on Twitch. Not on Twitch, but leave your comments on YouTube. Now, okay. I don't have the ability to set up forums on my site at the moment, uh, but I am going to post a new article in the off the cuff page. Or I might just start a new page for Richard Wednesdays with new topics every week. Um, so it goes. And here we go, beginning of the game. Begin in a dream. And a foot. I think we can infer what is happening here. Uh, now? You know I don't find that amusing. Mm -hmm. Also, avert your eyes if you are underage. Actually, if you're underage, you should be watching this anyway. Female partial nudity incoming, and there it is. It wasn't meant to amuse, but to prod you to hurry. It's midday already. You promised Siri you'd train with her. Go before Vesemir bores her to death with those etchings. <laughs> and look at all those scars. You wanna know I got these scars? So, later then. Hmm. See you later. Aw, oh, Yen, don't be like that. Oh. There you go. Nice goodbye kiss. <sighs> Go put a shirt on, girl. Yen, put some clothes on. Please. There we go. That's at least some close. All right, and we have control. Welcome to New Game Plus. A potion of clearance has been added to your inventory. You can use it to recover all your spent ability points so you can redistribute them. I actually did that not too long before I restarted. Um, so I think I'm set with my abilities, unless you guys have any opinions on that. If you guys want to comment on um, say what you think I should have, shouldn't have. Um, this was the stuff that I liked for my playthrough. Uh, just, you know, increasing effects damage 25%. 
increased chances of landing critical hits. Um, increased chances of landing critical hits with a, with a strong attack, increased strong attack damage 25%, and uh, slow time by an additional 45% while aiming the crossbow. I like that just giving you a little bit of extra time to aim the crossbow. For my signs, I added the melt armor to Igni. Um, fire stream alternate sign mode for Igni. Uh, Arden sweep alternate sign. You know, this is the one that you kind of slam the ground with Ard and it blows everybody around you back. Uh, active shields with Quen. So and hold hold the trigger to hold the shield up rather than uh, just throwing up the small shield. Then Axie, I did Delusion to increase the uh, effectiveness of Axie in dialogue. Um, as I said in the article on the site, it's just that something I used a lot my first playthrough was... You know, you get a lot of options where you can, okay, you can uh, beat these guys up or kill them. You can pay them off, or you can just use Axie, get them off your back. Uh, oftentimes, that's the option I would choose. Uh, and then, th this is a new one for me. I didn't have this until recently. Puppet with Axie. Uh, I believe there is an achievement for using this to have them kill for you. Uh, that's why I grabbed that. Uh, right now, I have a Greater Red Mutagen to increase my attack power by 10%. A Greater Blue Mutagen to increase my sign intensity by 10%. And two Greater Green Mutagens to increase my Vitality, give me some extra health. I'm all about that extra health. Alchemy, I do not have anything in alchemy. I never delved into it too much. I have, in terms of actual alchemy, I have most of the recipes and almost everything done. I have a few that I still need to research if I think there's one oil that I don't have all the way maxed out yet to the superior version. Did you go kill certain creatures to find it. Take a look at that in a minute. The rest of my things I have. Sun and stars. During the day, you get extra... regenerate health back. Uh, and at night, regenerate stamina faster. Survival instinct increased vitality. Like I said, I like having a lot of health. Especially now, like I said, first time I played through on uh, just the story. So now, this time, playing through sword and story. Um... I figure I might want to be even more careful this time. Uh, this is another one. I don't know what good this is. This might get replaced. This was just one that I got. Just throw it on there for now. And then strong back. Increase inventory. I am big on being able to have as much inventory carrying as possible. I am not... <laughs> I don't like running out of space for my stuff. As you can see there, though, I always say right now, I usually have that number closer to 80, so I don't really need a lot of inventory space because I do keep it pretty low. I keep it usually about 80, 90 on average. Uh, everything else extra I have above that usually gets sold off because it's usually extra swords, um, just the generic swords that I pick up off of uh, bandits and stuff. Also, with the expansion, you also get the new mutations here, which I'm working on getting the last couple unlocked. Just missing greater red mutagens or something I am short on right now. For whatever reason. Um, it also looks like these two I have here both require five ability points of each. So I'll be able to get one of them as soon as I get one more greater red mutagen. Um, Check out the other one. Right now, the ones I have available to me are Bloodbath. Each fatal blow dealt by a sword dismembers the enemy or activates a finisher. Each blow dealt by the weapon in melee combat increases attack by 5% until combat ends to a maximum of 250%. Damage is lost if you take damage. I use that. Swords deal 25% more damage to human opponents, immune to counterattacks and monsters. In all other cases, if the attack's vitality is less than 25%, I can attack immediately to the finisher. I've not triggered that have that one on either. Toxic blood. 
I'm not going to read all these right now, but they're basically they're the ones that I'm most interested in were this one here, which is when drawn magic, unique, and witcher swords increase sign damage by 50% of their own damage dealt. That was one that seemed to interest me. I had used that one for a little while. Uh, I also now have Piercing Cold, which is what I'm using right now. So the Ard has a 25% chance of freezing people. Opponents knocked down and frozen simultaneously die immediately. Opponents who are, f who are not frozen are dealt an additional 2,522 damage. So that's what I have going on there. Uh, obviously, I do not have access to my inventory right now because we're in the dream sequence at the beginning of the game. I will get, I will get in there momentarily. Additional content. So I got a couple of quests that are automatic because they're the uh, DLC quests they did for free. I'm just, I don't like having the dots next to anything, so I'm trying to clear them out real quick um, because they annoy me sometimes. If I do that. A lot. Just, please, just bear with me. I. It's one of those things that annoys me. But. We all make mistakes to errors. Human keys to move from one side to another. So, phrases to fix. When a mistake harms another, the injured party must be recompensed for his razzled nerves and lost time. We thus apologize and ask for forgiveness. Evil is not what we do. C to PR. I'm not sure what that is, actually. I don't remember that. Crafting. So this is all it's showing me right now, so I don't know... This is one of the things I was not sure of, is I wasn't sure how much of this stuff would carry over. Like all the recipes that I knew already, would I keep those recipes? Or would I have to refine them again? Uh, same with the Gwent. Was I have to gonna go was I gonna have to go recollect all of my Gwent cards? Or are they going to be there already? So I'm going to look at everything in here because I'm obsessed. Nothing but silver. Gold clashes with my complexion. You should know that. Mm, I do. I did know that, Yen. Also, all her clothes are black. You're running out of juice. I know. You might bring me some more once you're done training. So it's also been a while since I played this with headphones. I'd forgotten how good this stuff gets. They've gotten with the positional. Got any clothes that sound. aren't black or white? Hmm. Undergarments. See, I thought Siri could stand to wait a little longer. It's destructive, not to make it unreasonable. I want to stay with you a little longer. I missed you. A lot. And I missed you. But we'll have plenty of time to make up for that. Go and train with, with a her, unicorn. Then come back. It'll give me a chance to put my face on. Of all the women I've known, you're the only <laughs> one who does that before. You've known many. What's it matter? Only ever thought of you. Let's not go into that. That's a whole thing. Alright. What's your senses? Oh, I want to put that fire out. Lilac and gooseberries, of course. Gary, of course. Stop fingering my toilet trees. <laughs> yes, let's grab the key and move on. Shall we? We're not allowed to run yet either, so I have to walk, jump, and roll stairs into the next cutscene. Witcher's fast asleep. Ciri's disappeared somewhere, of course. 
Ah, uh, Vesemir. My old friend. Guess she prefers practice to theory. Hmm? What? Time to wake up, Master. These lessons so boring they put you to sleep too? Damn it. Better taking notes on ghouls and owl ghouls. Wanted to rest my eyes a bit. <laughs> Making her slog through that brick? No wonder she took off. John of Bruce lacks flair, true, but he's reliable. Not like the hogwash they print nowadays. She's tackling the pendulums, right? Yes, uh, the pendulum's a cool little thing. How many there? times do I have to tell her? Don't train alone, it only embeds your errors. Bring our young damsel to the lower courtyard. She wants to practice, she'll get to practice. Who spoiled her? Gotta admit, we've spoiled her. We've spoiled her. I've been <laughs> saying it from the start. Siri needs a firm hand. Mm -hmm. Been saying that true. But you let her walk all over you just like the rest of us do. <laughs> Fine. I suppose I'm partly to blame. But this has to end. Now. All right, Vesemir. Killing monsters is not something to be taken lightly. Siri must understand that if she's to become one of us. I'll see you below. Yes. Introduction to Siri. Wrong. Now I see why you were so eager to practice. Strike. And there goes your sword. Oh. You're not in this circus. Pirouette. Wrong. Footwork. Get down. With a flip? What do you think? All right. Take off the blindfold. I really like Siri. You've got work to do. Your reflexes are still slow. Maybe for a witcher. Think drowners or striggers <laughs> will go easy on you because you haven't undergone the mutations? Though in your shoes, I'd fear Vesemir more than any strigger. Disobeying his instructions? Unwise. Very unwise. Well, yes, but that book was horribly dull. I know. And you know that's no excuse. <sighs> I'm sorry. It won't happen again. It better not. Better not. Vesemir said if it does, he'll make you eat a bowl of slugs covered in salt. <laughs> you! Exactly. So you'd best behave. Come on, we'll practice with the others down below. Shall we run the walls? Not this time. Believe me, you don't want to keep Vesemir waiting. That's interesting. You know, the first time through it gives you the opportunity to choose, I'm guessing, because New Game Plus it thinks you already know how to do this, so you don't need to do it, so it skips past it. Interesting. Anything to say for yourself, young lady? I'm very sorry, Uncle Vesemir. Young blood craves action, I understand that. But when you fight a beast, knowledge counts as much as your silver sword. At the very least, you ought to be able to tell a ghoul from an owl ghoul. By markings, like unto the panthera tigris that in Zeracania dwells, and by the sickly paleness of its visage. Mm. So you did read the chapter. Still, you should have asked if... But you were asleep, Uncle Vesemir. She's got a point. So you did the reading. Why not admit it right off? Never pounce on an advantage as soon as it appears. Wait till it stands to have maximum effect. 
Uncle Vazimir's words. <laughs> well, you're a quick study. Turning quick, his words back but on him. mischievous. Fine, we've talked enough. Geralt, you're with me, Lambert with Eskel, Siri with a dummy. Again? Stop groaning and grab a sword. What do you think? Should we start by reviewing the fundamentals or go right to free training? Let's skip straight to free training. No point going over the basics again. Again, skipping over it. So it means tutorial stuff, so it makes sense that skipping it over. That leads us to this. Whoa! You really showed him, kid. Siri, get down here. Gotta get the helmet. <laughs> A little she-devil. Soon as she's back, we'll set her to polishing all the swords at Kaer Morhen. Find that helmet? Could take a while, even with four witchers. I seem to uh, collect a lot of swords. Siri? Uh, I'll make sure to find every last blade for you. <laughs> find them all. What's up with that dummy? What the? Don't do it, Geralt. Don't do it. It's snowing. <laughs> 